What's up everyone, in this video we are going to see the 4 best apps to transfer files from Android to your PC. The first one on the list is Send Anywhere. The free app allows you to send files, media, apps and more through a link, a key and the devices with the app installed. The easiest way to transfer to PC is to put the key on the website and the site will start downloading. I don't like this way because it takes time to upload and download on the device. Let's see the other apps. The second app I have is EasyShare. The app allows sharing of apps, photos, videos and music. It offers a few basic sharing features plus the FTP feature which works if the two devices are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Just tap on the FTP button and hit start. This will show you the IP address to put in the browser's address bar. The IP address is your local network address with an extension. After this is done, you will have access to all the files. The next is AirDroid. AirDroid is a popular app as it offers to transfer files between Android and PC. It comes with two methods. Install the AirDroid app on the PC and connect or tap on the AirDroid web option and use the IP address method to connect. If the devices are not connected with the same network, then you need to download the app on both the devices. In this video, let's go with the IP address because that one is the quickest. In the browser, the AirDroid works like the new OS. You get so many features such as download apps, media, open camera, access contacts and other device info. The app is free to use. The last one is Wi-Fi file transfer. The simple app uses the same IP address method to connect to access the files. Just go to the browser and insert the given address and you will have access to all the data until you hit that stop button. A few things to note if you are using the IP address method. In public networks, other people might be able to access the data. In that case, you can use the fourth app which is Wi-Fi file transfer. The app offers to set a password. Also, all those apps use the internet connection to upload and download on the server, which means the process will count towards your data if you have a limited plan. Anyway, I hope the video helped. Please like, share and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.